So the next thing we're going to start to talk about is the core connection. Now I showed you a picture in the class of the muscles of the core and a lot of people think the core is just round the belly button area so just the front of the tummy here but actually it, it encompasses all of the muscles from underneath the armpits down the sides all around the front down lower part of the pelvis and also around the back section here all the way down and also your glutes are a part of that powerhouse of the body and once you get these muscles really strong which is what Pilates is all about the peripheral movements of the muscles of the arms and the legs and the head and everything else become so much easier. An everyday task can become easier and you can become pain free because of it. So we really talk about that powerhouse of the core very much so. And sometimes we, you know, we've been going through our lives not really noticing it, not completely mindful of the muscles within that core area. So that's why I showed you the picture just to show you the muscles particularly that we talk about when we're doing the breathing um, part of the class. So I'm just going to show you in the lying down position because you can start to feel this much better when you're lying on your back rather than in standing. So just take uh, yourself onto the floor and I want you to be feeling about all of that section. So think about it like it's a corset around your body. Uh, the feet are flat on the floor and your knees are in line with the hips. And you're just going to have a feel, you know, take your hands to your tummy, have a good feel round. Now, the lower back has probably got a gap. And I want you to put your hand underneath the lower part of uh, the back where, there's, there, where there is that gap. And just have a feel of what that feels like. And I want you to inhale. And as you exhale, I want you to push your belly button down into your hand. Now, as you do this, you'll feel that your pelvis will be moving. So as we did uh, on the standing position, it moving forward and back, that's what will happen also on the floor. So you're pushing in to your hand and then releasing. So push down as you breathe out and as you inhale. So I'll just demonstrate. So breathe out and breathe in and breathe out. And breathe in so it's a very very subtle movement of the pelvis you're just tilting slightly this way and then tilting that way and tilting so I want you just to start to feel the vertebra on the lower part of the spine the bit where there's the curve pushing into that mat imagine it imprinting into the mat and then allowing it to release back into neutral so your neutral position is your natural stay stance in this position or this natural position and for me, I do have a, quite a large gap between my back and the mat, and that feels comfortable for me. So it's really important that you know your own neutral. And then also in this position, it's a really good way to indicate what our breathing is like. So when we breathe, you will be breathing through the rib cage. So I really try to start to think about the rib cage, and we'll talk about the breathing in the next video. I don't want to overload you too much.